Hi, this is Nicholas Forrest for New Art TV, and I'm here with Anna Pravachki at the Sydney Opera House. Anna will be performing one of her works, Music Derived Painkiller, as part of the Biennale of Sydney. So what is the concept behind this work? Well, the idea came out of... Um, I was growing up, I was studying to become a flutist, and um, I was practicing my flute one day. And after about, I don't know, three hours of practice, I put the flute down. And the next thing I know, on the floor, there's this puddle. Um, and I was quite puzzled by it. Um, didn't know where it came from until I realized that it was something that I made. I think it's quite interesting, especially within the context of this show where you have Manzoni's uh, Kant shit at the, yeah. at the Gallery of New South Wales. So we had the artist shit, we had the artist breath, mm -hmm. no? Mm -hmm. So artist saliva just seems like a logical <laughs> follow-up to, like the, follow to the uh, uh, bottled, uh, bottled uh, okay. fluids. And I was really intrigued by the connection between music being this very emotional display and practice and expression right. um, that then produces this gross matter. I like this poetic connection, yeah. you know, of like almost homeopathic uh, cycle of things, you know, yep. like you feel uh, a, a certain emotion or a, let's, say a, let's say a pain and right. you play a piece and then it pr produces the thing that cures it. So okay. Um, it makes like a perfect circle. Right, okay. Now, I've also produced these saliva wipes as well. Yes. As part of the work. So, yes. tell me a little bit about these. What is the idea behind these? Um, well, I, uh, because obviously it is not, it is, it's not uh, legal to right. distribute freely yes. bodily right. to it. Um, I actually read somewhere that uh, a couple of months ago a man spat on a police officer and uh -huh. the spit was dubbed as, uh, as a weapon. Right. Um, so w I wanted to, to be more cautious with, with sure. how I would go about it. But obviously there are all these nourishing, almost um, healing parts of, of the saliva. So I worked with a chemist in mm -hmm. Singapore and we basically isolated all the most beneficial things of saliva. So it has a lot of lactic acid, for example, uh, which is very good for the skin, and it's found in the saliva. So they're scent-free. Um, they have the consistency that, uh, that is similar to saliva. Uh, but the main thing is really the ingredients. Right. Now, one last question. What is actually going to be done with the saliva that you collect? From the performance. Uh, well, uh. I am. I am. Uh, I'm hoping uh, that uh, that I can produce a limited edition okay. of, of right. special, original, ah. artist-made okay. painkillers. Right. Pain right. Fantastic. So it's going to be kind of bottled, is it? And I think. Uh, uh, well, it depends. I, 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 I'm still seeing how much uh, saliva I produce tonight. I have about 100 milliliters right. from the last two practices okay. that I did at the MCA. So right. I'm quite excited today. And, uh, but it's a bit cool. So I don't know how yeah. how the music and the atmosphere. How much so we produce? I look forward to so. seeing some limited edition exactly. saliva in museums. Well, Thank you very much for your time, Anna, and uh, thank you. Good luck with your performance.